Now what? Nicky. Nicky? Do you think I'm going to leave? Please, give us a lot. No pulling hair. No pulling hair, yeah, exactly. Grabbing. No pulling clothes. Okay. Uh, no knee. No kicking. I'll say kicking. No breaking wind. Tickling. Huh? No tickling. No tickling. But you've got to stay in contact. Okay, so I want you to gently get me off balance. Oh, I forgot to tell you, if the foot moves, you lose a point. We're going to have a competition with this today as well. So you're going to have a foot, yes? Two points! Push when you want, I really don't want to. Why don't you push that? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Four points. What? Yeah, both feet moved. Oh, okay. Oh, well, by the way, my name's Tony or Sifu. <coughs> Sorry, I've got a cough. <laughs> Four points. Six points. You can push. I really don't mind. <laughs> you can push. You can get me off balance whenever you feel like it. I really don't mind. <laughs> I would appreciate if you stand still. Playing games. <laughs> oh, how many points is that? Well, another four. <laughs> 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 no! <laughs> hey, now, the point of this particular exercise, let's get this and uh, get an understanding. Okay, hold my wrist. Okay, hard. I want you to. Uh, you're not a violent person, I know, because I can see it in your face, you're a very nice person. But I want you to. <laughs> Stop me from pulling away. Yeah? No, no, no. Look, how old are you? I'm 14. 14. Pull then. Oh, okay. Okay? When he's pulling, and I am pulling, okay, we have conflict. We've got mental and physical conflict going on. I don't want him to pull me, so I'm trying to pull back. He is something like 30 years younger than me and he's stronger than I am. Okay? I don't want to fight his strength at all. So he's pulling, I go with his strength. <laughs> I go with his strength. I just use the touchy principles of being song. Song in English, closely translating, the nearest you get to it in English is relaxation but we don't want this sort of relaxation thing. I call it active relaxation. So he's pulling, I'm fighting, I don't want to fight, I want to be friendly. Okay, you want to be friendly. You want to be water, you want to overcome that type of thing as you go through. Uh, Sufu, would the word uh, yield be? Yield is good, yeah. we can yield, but we have to yield with a, it's quite interesting, with a positive attitude. It's not a weakness, it's a constructive strength. Absorb and return. Yep. So you're just feeling what's going on there. The weakest part of the hand is the thumb. So if he's gripping hard, hard, okay, I want to turn out of the thumb. Now do the other one. I want to turn out of the thumb. If he holds really tight and I'm turning up, good. See, he's stopping me now and I can't turn that out. And then I go, hi, how are you? <laughs> Look at him moving back. Again. So soft. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Notice what am I doing? High five. High five. Okay, done. Flat palm. 
Okay, in Tai Chi, we use open palm all the time. If you're using a fist, normally the aggressor, mentally, wants this fist to land on the nose, or the jaw, or the stomach. With an open palm, it covers more of the face. <laughs> you just have a moment, you take control of the face. In the classics of Tai Chi Chuan, they talk about um, four ounces to be a thousand pounds. Okay, and a prime example of that, if you've seen uh, a wild bull, or a bull that's got a ring through the nose, you can put a cotton thread through it and you can lead the bull. Uh, sometimes you get horses when they're wearing the harness, and they're being led. So it's always the head and the face that's taking that point. So we're always leading and being aware of taking the face out of the equation for self-defense. Now, what's the best form of self-defense? Block. Sorry? Blocking. Anybody else? Best form of self-defense. What? Oh, don't hit me, please! No. As far as I'm concerned, the best form of self-defense is you shouldn't be in that situation in the first place. Okay? All the way. It takes a lot more strength mentally and physically to walk away from confrontation than it does to embrace it. I can't tell you the amount of emotions that affect you afterwards. But having the strength mentally and physically to walk away from confrontation takes training. That is why you train in any of the arts. Because physically you're training yourself. Because you're physically training yourself, you're mentally training yourself. So it's a mind-body thing as it goes through. So now, if you'd like to stand up. <laughs>